What is up YouTube? It is Baseball Nerd back with another MLB The Show video. Today's video is going over all the new content that just dropped in the game. We got a new legend in a new player program that can go towards the first inning. We got a new part of the event, a new conquest map, a new set for headliners. We're going to go over all of that right now in this video. So hope you guys enjoy. Let's get right into it. So I'm moving myself up top. Now we can see most of the screen here. Um, the new legend is Houston Street. Looking at Houston Street here, we see the 124, 89 per nines. Really good per nines here. He's got 86 control, low velo at 60, and 99 break. So he's got a lot of break, decent amount of control, really good per nines. His repertoire is a four seam slider, circle change two seam. I like that he has the two seam. Sinker or cutter would have been nice, but I don't know if he ever threw those in his career. So I love the pitch repertoire enough for the stats on the card. Um, looking at his control, he has really good control, which is really nice to have, especially with your closer. And then the break is also very good. Everything above 80 for control and break. I love to see this and I like the Houston Street card. So it's gonna be really fun to use him and see how he does this year. This is an X angel so I'm kind of hyped about this card. That's cool. He could potentially be on the all-time angel team build. He was a nice um, closer for the Padres and played for us and a couple other teams, I believe. But 35,000 XP going towards the first inning program. That's a nice little jump there in the first inning. Let's go into Diamond Dynasty, though. Check out all of this stuff. So if we go over to Shop, we can go to Packs, click Buy Packs, and we see this new headliner, Oral Hershizer is the set for headliner. We can check out his card really quick. He got pretty good per nines, really good stamina, good control, decent velo, good break. He's got a sinker, cutter, curveball, changeup, four seam. Pretty good repertoire right there. I like that repertoire a lot. Um, pretty good control on everything minus the changeup. 80 and above on everything and 90 and above on the sinker and the four seam. That's pretty nice control. Really nice break too. This is not a bad card to have right here. Oral's normally pretty decent in the game, I would say. Coming over to programs, clicking on player programs, we have the new Houston Street right here. You need to get a total of 50 of these points to get him. Along the way, you'll get two packs and an extra. You get three packs and about 1,500 stubs. Um, you can do missions where you have to get online 10 strikeouts with relief pitchers, online tally one save with a Padres pitcher. This one you could do against the CPU, defeat the Padres on all-star difficulty or higher. That'll get you eight points. I always do that one just to get a quick eight. Um, there's moments, seven. 14, 21, 28, 35, 42. So as always, if you do all the moments for Houston Street, they're all on veteran, not very hard. And then go to missions and you play the CPU, the Padres on all-star difficulty. You play the nine innings, you win. You get those eight points. That will be 42 plus eight. That gives you 50 right there. That is what I always do 99.9% .9 of the time. I, unless I already have these missions knocked out from playing online and I didn't even notice it, then I always just do the moments, come in here, play the team on CPU and it's really easy. That'll get you your Houston street card ASAP. Just make sure you don't forget to go over to the first inning. Once you get him, go down to collections and add him into this collection to get your 35,000 XP. Cause if you don't do that, you will not get the XP for the first inning program. So make sure you come over here and put him in this collection. Going over to single player modes. There's a new conquest map as well. The first inning umbrella. It expires May 7th as well. The teams you can see already have all these spots filled up. So it's going to be a little bit of a struggle for the simulating of games. But you got 5 mil to go against 1 mil for the most part. So you should sim most of these. Um, you need to steal 4 million fans. I hate when we have to steal fans, but it's all right. You can either try to steal all 4 million on playing a Hall of Fame game. Or you can do 2 games of veteran or whatever you want to do to get the 4 million. The rest is pretty much just conquering and capturing all of the territories in the umbrella. Nothing that you have to do in a particular order like some maps. But you're going to get one, two, three, three show packs, a ball and a habit pack, and whatever else is hidden in this map. I'm sure there's a couple packs or stubs hidden around this map. So I would definitely bang this one out, try to get it done as soon as possible. It looks like it goes towards the first inning program as well. Let me double check that for you guys. Yeah, so the first inning umbrella conquest map will be 15K for the first inning program. So along with doing your Houston Street and this conquest map, that'll give you 50,000 XP to go towards your first inning program. And looking at the reward path, I'm at 377,000. So another 50K will take me over this headliners pack. That will be awesome. I'll be really close to getting 10 packs. So definitely want to grind those two out. That's going to help us a lot. So we saw Oral Hershiser in the set four headliner. We got the Houston Street player program. Make sure to lock him in. And then we got the new conquest map we're going to bang out and make that 
all done today but there was another thing that got updated today and that is events looking at events it looks like your wins carry over i only played three games i went three and oh and i forgot to keep playing it so that's my fault um i've been doing a lot of different stuff but it stayed at 60 wins so you can still get 60 wins and it's the same reward so you can still get miggy and that john smoltz card it just switched it's now national league pitchers and american league hitters it's still max team 85 overall three inning games on all-star so you can come in here and grind out this if you still want to get miggy i might do this shortly just to get the free packs um up in here maybe sell this bat um sell anything i can that i don't need and then get to miggy but once you get to miggy it's really hard not to just get five more wins for the ball and then five more for the five packs and then when you're there it's like well i can get 10 more wins and i can get 10 packs so that's normally what happens to me i just go for miggy and then i get here and i want to just finish out the rest because it looks too juicy you know packs are packs packs are fun so if you want to grind that out they updated the event as well today so guys that is it for today we have the new houston street new legend player program like i said lock them into the first inning we got the conquest map we got the oral hershizer and the set four headliners and we have the new updated event where they switched AL and NL for pitchers and hitters. So if you want to grind that out, grind that out as well. New content today. You got to love it. Content days are the best. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Go knock out some first inning XP and keep grinding that reward path. I'll see you on the next one as always. Peace. Peace.